All right, that was fun. Court's always fun, right? <laughs> So truly, truly, I am excited to be here. Um, not not because I want to be here. See, what happened is the buildings that we purchased, the old family life buildings, they had a missing awning and uh, need some paint work and things on the outside, which totally 100% planning to do. We've been focused on the inside for the past uh, 10 months or so. So, and then we're waiting for the weather to break. I have estimates. You guys have seen that in previous videos. We're, we're working on it. We're getting there. But in the meantime, I got a fine in the mail, codes violation for those things. So I had to come today, we got a continuance, we're gonna continue to work on it. Obviously, like you guys know, I'm, we're gonna get it done. <laughs> but the reason it excites me to come to court is because if it's happening to me, certainly it must be happening to some of the other buildings that we know aren't moving forward. So, so as long as there's activity, as long as things are moving, it's an exciting thing because it means that the borough is doing what the borough is supposed to do, which is make sure that these properties continue to move forward and make progress and I understand they hired someone that's supposed to be working on the vacancy ordinance which I think is the most important one and um, yeah progress is progress even if I get caught up in the uh, cement mixer it's okay it's good there's movement happening Most people I talk to about this, they're like, oh, I can't believe they would do that to you. Don't they know how much you do for Katanning? Like, no, 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 no. I'm not a special person. I don't deserve special treatment. I'm just happy that it's moving. And so let's, uh, let's just pray that it's not just me. Like if I'm being targeted, obviously, then I have a problem with it. I don't think that's the case. I think that this is a, just a blanket improvement in the codes program and it needs to happen. So I'm glad about it. Trust me, I'm very, very happy about it. Thank you, Katanning Borough, for taking me to court. <laughs> now, parking tickets I'm not happy about. Katanning, you can get rid of the meters anytime, and I will celebrate in the streets. So my court date, just one, you know, small part of the exciting uh, things going on right now. Got a busted hose there. Just gonna repair it for, uh, for the community garden. salvage a decent 50-foot hose. So that's something we can use at the community garden here over the next month or so. Uh, well, through the whole summer, probably. <laughs> Got the flower buds starting on the cherry trees. Got the daffodils coming out of the ground. Like, it's about to explode with life down here, friends. One bank to the next. So I don't know if I said too, I got three more quotes on the front of my two buildings. So those are starting to come in. Uh, they, all the people came and visited. I'm waiting for the quotes to come back. So we'll see how those turn out. Uh, we got other stuff happening downtown here. I just followed up with the borough. Still trying to get info on some of these empty buildings. That one, this one right here. And the other 27 that we identified all throughout the downtown. So hoping to have like a more full report on that in the next couple weeks. We'll see how that goes. And uh, yeah, overall, just going really good. Hello. I, you did give me one earlier, so now I had to come. Or just your hand. <laughs> All right. Got an Americano today and a five pound bag of beans. You know, you gotta have the beans for the office. might not have known you could do five pound bags there, but you can. So if you if you need a big one for your house, if you're a big coffee drinker. So yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff happening right now. And you know, I'm not gonna let the little uh, court case uh, throw off anything that we're trying to do. It's just like a little speed bump on the road of progress here. And so I still have this unshakable positivity that this is going to be an amazing year. Uh, it really has this kind of springtime vibe right now. Not only the crazy weather, but all the different things that are happening 
happening right now across the city that seems like things are really awakening. There's a lot of good things happening right now. Uh, the one other thing that I wanted to show you, I haven't seen it myself, but I heard that they're starting to clean up the big fire uh, site at Inwick City, so I want to go over there and check that out before I go home. I'm hoping that the weather will cooperate with me and I can do a little more work on my home garden, but um, not hold not too much hope. It was like really cold, then sunny, nice. Now it's rainy. Uh, it's getting darker by the minute, and then uh, and then like the sun will pop out. So it's very uh, unpredictable this time of year. But maybe that's just how springtime goes. We just need to have faith that better things are on the horizon, <laughs> and we need to just keep pushing forward, uh, keep moving, and keep uh, just embracing all of the new life happening around us. Weather really does turn on a dime. There's like a cold wind blowing now. It was nice earlier when I was walking around. I don't know, it doesn't look good for the garden. Let's see how this property looks. <laughs> This is pretty great. Obviously still a lot of damage around. These will all be separate insurance claims, but this huge building, got a nice flat lot here now, all filled in, all the metal taken out. The house that was here is gone. I'm assuming we'll see uh, the neighbor's houses here improving over the coming months. I'm sure there's tons of insurance claims to settle and there'll be a huge you know, liability one stemming from this one. So it's just uh, one of those things that'll take time, but man, this is huge progress and it's looking really great. That was a very devastating event for that entire block and obviously there'll be some remnants there for quite a long time, but I know a lot of people that I talked to were fearful that that was going to take years to make any progress, but I'm happy to report progress is happening. So stay positive, my friends. It really is going to be an awesome year in the greatest city in the world.